Lucy's Below D by Chris Duke. Lucy Pear has wonderful hair. It changes colour like no other. When the sun shines bright and things seem right, her hair is as yellow as that big bright light. When her little brother Brad makes her really, really mad, her hair goes red as her redhead dad. One day her friend got a brand new toy, her hair went green with envy, no sign of joy. When Lucy's excited, full of happiness and glee, her hair goes bright purple for everyone to see. But one day she woke and the sun wasn't so bright. She didn't feel happy, she didn't feel right. Lucy didn't know where to look and she didn't know what to do because that morning she woke and her hair was dark blue. She didn't know why she felt so sad, why her hair was so blue, why she didn't feel glad. She didn't want to leave home that day and she wished the blue feeling would just go away. Why is your hair blue? her mummy asked, but giving an answer seemed an impossible task. She didn't know why she felt so low, why her hair didn't have that bright golden glow. Up and dressed and off to school, her classmates thought her hair was cool. Her teacher said it's not that bad, but she just couldn't say it's because I'm sad. Her friends didn't get it. Why are you so sad? You're always so happy. You're always so glad. I'm always happy, this much was true, but she couldn't say why her hair was so blue. At lunch, Lucy ate as much as she could consume when a sight caught her eye from across the room. Her friends said, Lucy, look, someone like you. And she looked up to see more hair so blue. She could see he had a smile on his face, a smile so bright, no sadness could erase. But why, asked Lucy, is your hair so blue? Do you feel the sadness that I feel too? The boy looked at Lucy with his bright green eyes and knew his next words could not be lies. Don't worry, Lucy, if your hair goes blue. We all have days like this, mums and dads and teachers too. It's important to know it's okay to be sad. It's okay to be angry. It's okay to be mad. And if you wake up one day and your hair is blue, please don't worry because that's okay too. We all have blue days, but it will disappear and your beautiful hair will again reappear. Tomorrow you will wake and the sun will shine bright and today will fade like a dream in the night. That night at home with her mum and her dad, she told them she felt a little bit sad. But I'll be fine, she began to say, because it's okay sometimes to have a blue day.